was it bad? Freezing. Really cold? It was bloody cold. 100 years ago, a small group of swimmers had the crazy idea to jump into Vancouver's English Bay on New Year's Day. Who would have thought that a century later and the tradition would continue with thousands of brave souls taking the plunge? How do you feel right now? I feel a little nervous, but I'm not much nervous. Starting 50 this year, so this is the way to start it off. You guys ever done it before? Oh, yes. I'm a Pantasia, so it's in my I have to. <laughs> The swim was started by Peter Pantages. Peter made it a daily ritual, no matter what the weather, to take a dip in English Bay. But in the year 1920, he brought along some friends. It's come a long way since the days of nine swimmers who half went in on a bet because he swam daily, so it wasn't a big deal for him, but it was a pretty big deal for them. Since that first group plunged and formed the Polar Bear Swim Club, they have inspired thousands of swimmers every year, fair or foul, to head into the cold waters and start fresh for the new year. And Peter's granddaughter couldn't be happier to be leading the masses as president of the club on its 100th anniversary. I think he would be so proud. Um, he was all about family and bringing people together and celebrating life. So I think this ticks all of those columns. Are you ready? They're off, or in, I guess I should say. Some of the more ambitious polar bears will swim 100 yards to the boys, but others are just in for a quick winter dip. How do you feel? I feel so good. I'm good, my God. Let's get in there. You know, I just did my best, you know, show my heart out, you know, for all the people, you know, I'm on top of the world, baby. In Vancouver, Ashley Burr, City News.